Alrighty, update. Lucky number 13. Lucky because uh, I had some good luck today. Uh, just want to start off by saying, you know, just thoughts and prayers and my heart goes out to everybody in Florida. Um, family, friends, human beings, and, you know, the Caribbeans too, and just everywhere that everybody's affected, you know. Um, anyways, they're in my thoughts. But, uh, just want to go over real quick uh, several things that I got done today. Felt pretty good about it. You'll see stuff flying through there that's sawdust probably still being blown around because I have done some major cutting today. But, Passenger side is complete. Glued, nailed, it's good. Good to go. Um, I can't even show you all this over here under the table, but it's all glued and nailed and everything's good. Uh, got this one cut here. It's going to be where the tub is. Just got the tub pushed over there out of the way. Uh, going to have a nice little shelf up here once we trim this out and we're gonna box part of it in but probably keep part of it open for like a shelf but yeah that's cool um got this other side all cut i still got to go back and trim off the top ledge of the long piece there and all cut and put into place got the front all cut trimmed out ready to go and thought for sure I was going to have enough glue to finish up and sure did not. I ran out. So I got this piece here glued in, nailed in, and then I ran out. I tried to use some liquid nails I had left and I ran out of it on the same board. So got to grab some more of that before I can finish the rest of this up. But I think it looks pretty good, you know. Um, it's going to be finished out, stained polyed all that good stuff but, or oiled maybe I don't know for sure what Sony's gonna do but I, I'll have them all in place for her whenever she gets back uh, so yeah it was a lot of cutting I still got a lot of cleaning to go tonight I made a lot of cuts today I got these pieces here these corner pieces done this is this is all one piece going all the way to the floor here I had to just draw this out figuring out where I need to make my little chops and nicks and it took quite a while but I think it turned out pretty good down here on the bottom right there where that knot is this board has broken completely apart but I don't think anybody will ever know that except for you all who I've told but yeah got that part done over here on this side I got it done as well so I felt pretty good about that those took quite some time because I had to trim out and keep Trimming down, trimming down, trimming down. But it worked out. I got it. I should have got the jigsaw out, but I didn't. The old Ryobi's been through it. It's it's had a rough day. The top of the handle here where you lift the blade guard up broke off on me today. And I've got it over there. I just got to try to put it back together somehow. Cause it is pretty annoying to not have that on there but hey it worked out and I didn't cut myself so that was a good day um, just want to talk about a few products that are you know good um, nobody's paying me to talk about these obviously with my with our uh, 7 to 10 views but uh, you know Ryobi is a great tool it really is so I just wanted to mention that this is an old saw but man I mean it it's been through it and it's hung in there and then Diablo brand uh, saw blades right there if anybody needs a saw blade I suggest you buy Diablo this blade is old 
very old, three years old probably, and it went through all those cuts through that Luon. Really, it's not the exact right teeth for Luon, but man, I mean, it went through it, cut everything. It is definitely getting worn out. It is going to be time for a new one. I will say that for sure, but it did the job and it got it done. And then also, reach down here and get this one. I haven't put it away yet. But the Stanley Electric Stapler, um, it's cheap. Sony's had this thing for quite some time, 25, 30 bucks. And uh, does great, you know. It just, uh, I got it turned all, got the pressure turned all the way up on it, but it, it does it, it does the job. And uh, using these Stanley brand Brad nails to go with it. To go through and they go through the luon just fine no problem five eighths inches long through the luon into the two by fours no problem whatsoever so those are just some suggestions for anybody who may be looking at a video like this and you know just needing to figure out what's what's good to use those are some suggestions so yeah, I feel good about it. Um, I got a lot of cleanup left to go. I'm going to have to get more glue before I can finish these wall boards. Um, and then we'll be doing a trim, like a, a little window ledge on top of here. But, you know, it's, it's going to have to be uh, removable so that if you ever need to get to these windows and take these windows out, you can take them out. So... Um, I'm sure that won't probably won't work on those ledges or trim these walls are going to be trimmed out as well like you know see where these seams are and stuff there'll be trim boards on here right here in this location which is like the only empty location on the bus right now is where there's going to be the second bed which will be a couch it's like a slatted thing we're going to build it on our own and um, it'll be a you know a couch here in the seated position probably just no back on it just a cushions or whatever and then you can uh, pull out the front of it pull it out another couple feet or whatever and you know it'll make a full-size bed right here in this area so that'll be cool I can't wait to start on that one but uh, next step be clean up I got a lot of cleanup to go after this day. I'm going to try to gather up all the, uh, you know, leftover pieces of wood and things. I, I got quite a little stack going in here of all the wood that, you know, we may or may not be able to use, but um, we'll see how it goes. I was thinking about taking all these leftover from the pickets and trying to make some type of a uh, little shelf out of them somehow probably something that would kind of hang or be attached uh, to some metal trim metal or something maybe in the kitchen area or something like that but yeah I feel good about it, it was a good day um, but it's dark outside and I need to clean up and get back on it get some glue maybe tomorrow I don't know just wait and see but anyways everybody have a good night and uh, check back for updates peace out